Ha! Hey everyone, Hassan here. Welcome to the world of Ha. Today I got another Power Rangers Dino Charge review for you. This is the Toys R Us exclusive Red Ranger Deluxe training set. So they have different training sets available, but this is the Toys R Us exclusive version, so it's got a couple differences. Uh, I, I don't remember exactly what the difference is, but I believe one of them is the fact that you got something gold plated up here. A little Dino Charge more for there, so that's pretty neat. Uh, but I wanted to get this one because I like shiny things and just to open it up, show you guys what it's like. So inside you got the Dinocom and the basic Dino Saber. I believe those two are the exact same things as their individual releases, but we'll test it out and see. You got a uh, Dino Charge Red Ranger mask right there without a, a visor. Um, and then a gold plated Dino Charge Morpher. It is not the deluxe Dino Charge Morpher. It's a basic version of it. So we'll check that out and see what it has as well as a uh, Tyrannosaurus Rex Dino Charger right there also. So this is that, so it's a nice big packaging, typical for the, the training sets. Uh, I'll fold this around, and again, it kind of shows you all the different pieces, all the different components there. I love the, the images on the back of the boxes. They either use some really cool artwork or awesome promo art. Like that just looks such, just high quality, it looks great. Just, yeah, just awesome stuff that they have here. But anyways, so uh, this is the Deluxe Dino Charge uh, Red Ranger Deluxe Training Set, basically. Uh, so let's uh, open this up and take a look. All right, so I have the Red Ranger Deluxe Training Set out of the box. Here are all of the contents right here. Let's actually just move this giant box out of the way. So, uh, yeah, first things first, let's take a quick look at the actual mask. I will wear the mask in a little in a little while later in this video, so you'll kind of get a feel for it. Uh, but here it is right here, pretty basic, uh, but looks cool. I do love the design of the helmets that they have for uh, this season. Uh, definitely pretty cool, and I'm sure kids will love to, to dress up as the Red Ranger and, and wear the mask, so that, that's definitely a lot of fun right there. Um, so the next thing that I want to actually take a quick look at is the actual dino charger right here so uh oops let me kind of zoom in on it so this is the tyrannosaurus rex dino charger that you see so this is number one um i'll kind of flip through the screens that you see there um and then of course tyrannosaurus rex there's your qr code pretty basic stuff same thing that you've kind of seen a million times uh quick little comparisons here's oops uh, here's another one with the white outline from one of the Dino Charger power packs, I believe, or maybe from one of the other toys. There's a whole bunch of different ways you can get this Dino Charger. Here's one with the red number there. Uh, this one is a little smaller. So this one that came with the Deluxe Training Set had the bigger Dino. Not sure if that's random or if that's how they all are. Uh, here's the one with the foil, just for comparison's sake as well. And then last but not least, there's the translucent one that I believe came with the Megazord. Um, so there's that. So anyways, that is the Dino Charger. You've seen it a million different times. Um, so pretty basic. I'm not going to show it to you in the app because you've already seen it and it's going to take too long. Actually, I take that back because I'm recording this on the 4th of July. Um, the actual app has uh, the, there's apparently a, a, something that you can get by scanning it on the 4th of July. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna load that up. But in the meantime, let me do this here. Um, real quick, at random, it just said the 4th of July, it said like you've completed that morph on the 4th of July, so I've now leveled up, um, so I just kind of want to show that. So anyways, that's what I want to show. So I got the 4th of July notification. So, uh, if you're watching this, well, it's probably already too late, but the next 4th of July, open up the Dino Charger app and you'll get that, uh, that notification. Uh, anyways. Okay. And we'll turn that off. There we go. So, again, same thing you've seen a million times. What you have not seen before is this very shiny Dino Charge Morpher right here. Oh my goodness, that is that is very reflective and definitely a fingerprint magnet as well. Uh, really cool. Now, uh, 
I love shiny stuff, so that is awesome. Uh, the downside to this is this has no lights or sounds. This is not a deluxe morpher or anything. Uh, also, I don't like what they did here. Um, I don't know why they didn't make this shiny. I, I get the orange. They have to put that on the, you know, the any guns that are sold in America. I, you know, whatever. But why did they not make this a shiny gold? Because this kind of makes it stick out a little bit. It looks a little weird. But still, I love this whole shiny thing they have going. Uh, there's also this thing at the top here. Um, not sure specifically uh, what what that's really for. Um, it's just. It's just there, I guess, which is interesting. Um, it doesn't like, there's no like connecting or anything with this. It just, that's just, it's just there. So I don't know what's, what that is for, but hmm, interesting. Anyways, here's the uh, Deluxe Dino Charge Morpher. So um, it is a little bit smaller. Uh, it is a little bit smaller because I guess, you know, they took out the internals. Like this does not spin. Uh, there's no, you know, sounds, anything like that. So uh, they could kind of reduce the size a little bit. So there's that. Would have been cool to actually have the Dino Charger more for a gold version of it. That would have been pretty amazing. But it is what it is. So there's that. Um, the uh, There's also, real quick, I just wanted to do a comparison since I like gold stuff. Here's a bunch of different gold things that I have. So in case you want all sorts of shiny stuff, they're shiny right there. I do also have the gold deluxe legendary morpher. I forgot to grab that as well, but shiny stuff is cool. So I like, you know, gold versions of things. Uh, these two are, were also in training sets as well. So they're kind of sticking with the theme of having gold shiny stuff in training sets, which is pretty cool. Now this thing, you can insert a dino charger in here. So there is that. So you can, you know, you insert it in right here. And uh, oops, you gotta kind of push it in a little bit. Ta-da! There you go. That's that's really cool, right? Well, no, it doesn't do anything. You can't pull the trigger. Nothing happens. It's just there. Um, and then you can just pull the tab right here. You just lower this tab, and then it just slides right out. That's it. Pretty boring. Um, so yeah, don't expect much with this dyno charger, but it's nice and shiny, I suppose. One thing I was actually a little surprised about, I thought this was the same thing as the Dynocom. It's not. This is the Dynocom without the sounds. Um, whoops, here is the actual Dynocom toy that's released. It looks the exact same, right? Looks the exact same there. Everything about it looks the same here, including the little tab that you pull out, the Try Me tab. They left the space in there too. Everything about this looks the same, except this button. Power Rangers Dino Charge. This one does not push. There's, there's no button there. And if you were to hold down this to open it up, again, same storage capacity, same thing there. But you'll notice on this one you got the little battery pack. This one doesn't have anything. Clearly, it could have been there, but they just kind of swapped out the internals um, on this. So in order to uh, save money or something, or offer incentive to purchase the Dynocom separately, the, the one in this deluxe training set does not have sounds. So if you just wanted the Dynocom for the looks, for the storage of the Dino Chargers, then the training set version is the exact same size, look, everything about it, it's perfect. But if you want the cool sounds, then you're gonna have to get the Dynocom separately. So keep that in mind. Uh, however, the basic Dino Saber is the exact same. So this one does fold. You can insert the Dino Charger, everything right there. I just did a review of this recently as well, so you can check that out. But again, here's the, the one that I did the review of, so you'll see it's the exact same thing. Um, so at least the basic Dino Saber there, if you wanted to buy that, you can just get this and then not have to worry about it. It does not come with the, the blue Dino Charger, but you know, you can get that a million other different ways. So that is that, that is what comes in this deluxe training set. Um, the, you know, all these different components here. So um, if I think this is a great set for kids uh, cause they have everything they need to, to morph up into a Power Ranger. You know, they, they can uh, wear the Red Ranger mask. They got like a, a morpher, which is nice and shiny and cool. Even though there's no sounds and stuff, I think kids will enjoy this set. And obviously that's what it's geared towards. But any kind of a collector or anything, just just pass on this. Um, I mean, unless you really want this. In fact, this is the, really the only reason why I bought the set. I was not planning on buying training sets, but I can't resist having really shiny stuff. So this is really the only reason I bought it. But 
this thing has like no features. So the only redeeming factor is the shininess. So if that's really what you like, the shiny stuff, then get the set. Otherwise, you know, collectors, you can pass on it. But I think kids will, will definitely love this set. But anyways, that's my review of the deluxe training set. Thank you all so much for watching. I'm about to put on the mask, uh, but other than that, uh, that's it for the review. So thank you all so much for watching. Please subscribe if you haven't already. You got lots more reviews on the way. Thank you, and I will see you guys later. All right, guys, here goes nothing. Here's the mask. I'm gonna put it on, and yeah, there's that. Obviously not geared towards an adult head. Um, uh, it is definitely small. My chin is sticking out right here. But it's actually, you know, com other masks in the past have been very uncomfortable for an adult. This one is okay, so it's actually not too bad in that sense, but, you know. Bam, there you go. Here's the deluxe training set. Definitely geared towards kids, and I think kids will love it. And they also do have other training sets of other Color Rangers as well, in case kids are interested in that. Uh, so definitely check that out. Thank you all so much for watching, and I will see you guys later.